I'm gonna give you a perspective on what's going on with Steven Crowder and the Daily Wire that most people really haven't thought about. So most people are really kind of upset, I guess, at him recording or whatever, exposing the people that are upset and people that are fans of him are going to be fans of him. This is the reality of it is, he did do an expose on them, period. But he's done that with a lot of things and we've all cheered him on for it. So why not with this? Because if he's exposing something that's not right, that's damaging the future of people that have the freedom to speak their minds about subject matters that not might, might not be ad like ad friendly, you know, it gives an opportunity. Pardon any crazy noise in the background. The cats are having a. F but back to the point, we shouldn't be anyone on, on the side of things that have been for free speech. Shouldn't be going after Stephen Crowder for what he's exposed. Look, the contracts aren't fair. They own you, just like every other corporation has done in the past. It's no different. Guys, it's, it's very clear on, on the surface of value. Don't keep getting caught for the same traps. Just because they wear, you know, a certain veneer and an attitude for you doesn't make them good people. They've always told you they're about their money and they brag about how awesome they are about getting your money. You know, that's why we tell you to stay in scripture, you know, because you don't get caught up in these little feuds. You start to see the truth of things. Stephen Crowder is doing what Stephen Crowder has always done. And for the most part, it's a good thing. So, you know, let's let's look towards this with some kindness and grace. And uh, if you're watching my, like my stuff and you watch their stuff, all their stuff too, try to be like a stand back and look at it from far away. We want to thank you guys and have a blessed day.